Now to the bride and groom, who are on many levels a perfect match. Really, they are. Kyle Freilich needed a kidney to save his life, but never expected to find love along the way. ABC's Rena Ninen is here with this incredible story. Hey, Rena. Hi, guys. Good morning. It really is an incredible story. It was at age 12 that a screening suggested Kyle Freilich might have kidney failure. By 17, he was on dialysis. By 18, he was in search of a kidney transplant to keep him alive. Senior year of high school holds so much promise for most teens, but for Kyle Freilich, it seemed more like a death sentence. Prior to the transplant, the doctors were saying, with my blood type and my age, at minimum, I was looking at like three to five years to receive a kidney. In 2009, he met a girl at a car show. Chelsea Claire had heard about Freilich's situation from a family friend. When I actually met him, I just knew, and I had told him that I wanted to give him a kidney. And while he wanted to believe she would follow through, he didn't hold on to that hope. I thanked her, and I was appreciative that she said that, but I just I assumed that it wasn't actually going to happen. Little did he know, Chelsea understood the importance of life-saving donations better than most. My dad had passed away of cancer, and he needed a bone marrow transplant, so I just felt like I would have wanted somebody to step up and help us, so I just wanted to help him. They were a perfect match. She agreed to give the stranger her kidney in spite of her family's concerns. As it got more serious, um, they got real worried, which I understand, but they were okay with it after they realized I wasn't going to change my mind. <laughs> after passing all the necessary tests, less than a year after their fateful meeting, Chelsea and Kyle went under the knife. We both have been doing very great since the surgery. Um, I don't feel any different than I did before I gave a kidney. I feel um, a lot different than yeah. I did before I got a kidney. <laughs> Kyle felt good an hour after surgery. The good feeling continued as the two started seeing each other. And two weeks ago, Chelsea vowed to spend the rest of her life with the man whose life she saved. I joke with him sometimes. If we get in an argument, I'll tell him I'm going to take my kidney back. And then we just both laugh and it's over. <laughs> yeah. They have such a good sense of humor. The couple now have an 11 month old baby and a seven year old daughter from Chelsea's previous marriage. And you know, there are nearly 99,000 people who are waiting for kidney transplants. And I love how uh, she can always play the kidney card now. Yeah, I love Keep that. Keep that yeah. in yeah. for the rest of her life. <laughs> Taking that back. It's a hard threat to follow yeah. through on. Thank you very much. Appreciate it.